Here's a distant shot of the aquaponic grow bed supporting the uh, 500 gallon uh, African cichlid uh, haplochromus tank. Uh, uh, you know, the shot is, is uh, intended to show you what it looks like from uh, top to bottom. There's a, there's a uh, sort of a trellis that is in a horizontal position near the top that the uh, pothos uh, grows over. If I move in a little bit, uh, just a few things that I'm trying to do here. Since the, uh, the natural light, the south exposure, uh, is coming in through the window, I'm trying to use plants of various heights to take, to take advantage of uh, the light that's uh, coming in the window at all levels. I've got, uh, most recently I added some, and they're just starting to grow, some uh, low-growing uh, philodendrons. Uh, of course, moving up, I've got uh, the Chinese, colorful Chinese evergreens. Uh, there's the uh, dwarf papyrus that uh, is growing like nuts. And of course, uh, there's uh, this uh, overarching pothos. It's kind of a crown over the whole area that's uh, probably 50% of the total uh, plant mass of the aquaponic uh, row bed. So anyway, part of my strategy to uh, keep the nitrates low, the water pure, making my fish room more uh, interesting and uh, natural. And uh, hope you enjoy this part of it. This is a shot of my aquaponic grow bed from uh, outside my uh, my fish room uh, uh, outside the window that that uh, is used to uh, uh, provide natural lighting to the grow bed. So I just wanted to show it to you on a sunny day. You can see uh, it's starting to cover the window, so I'm likely going to have to find a way to uh, to uh, maybe uh, provide some uh, lighting adjacent uh, artificial lighting adjacent to uh, the window to allow this uh, bed to expand further. Quick uh, shot of the sump and the fact that uh, we've got the pothos that's growing near the window also sending shoots down here and uh, growing under the lights that illuminate uh, my uh, sump. So the pothos is pretty aggressive. It you know finds a place where there's light, and uh, uh, you know this makes it one of the more popular, I think, and and uh, useful plants, terrestrial plants for uh, for uh, aquarium keepers.